Hi there. I'm making sauce for tomorrow with meat in it. And I just realized that I should probably be documenting this video. So I'm going to start. So I have spicy and sweet Italian sausage in this pot. I put a little bit of oil in the pot and put the sausage in. I cut them in half because it's going to be a lot of people. And I just figured it would be easier. Um, and I like brown them on the bottom of the pan in a little bit of oil for just a little bit of time. I kind of seared them. And then I put, oh, I'm making for a lot of people, so I did six cans of tomatoes in there. Right? And it's on pretty low because you don't want it to start splashing all over the place and it's going to cook for a while. And obviously you know what I use, but here it is just in case. You can experiment with other brands if you can't find it. This is my preferred favorite. My meatballs are made with the meat loaf mix. And um, I'll show you that in a second when I make them. So you see here, like you, when you do the cans, like when you pour it all out, there's like a lot of sauce left. So what I do is I put like some water in the can. You see how high that is? And then I go to each can and I'm going to go back and forth to get out all of the, like to clean the can. But that way you're getting like almost a whole nother can of like watery tomato sauce that is also going to go in that pot. And the meatballs I'm going to bake. And then I'm going to put those in the pot. They might not all fit. And if I was making brujol, or if you were putting any, like, beef bones or anything like that, that would all go into the pot. And I'm also going to put a whole head of garlic. I'm going to put some basil. And I'm going to put um, powdered garlic, salt, and pepper. And I'm going to do that to taste. So, you know, that you could do it at your own taste. And I guess I don't really have to say that if you wanted your sauce to be with, like, vegetables in it, or if you didn't want meat, or, like... You want some mushrooms instead, like you could definitely do this sauce with anything in it or nothing in it. And you can make the meatloaf, the meatballs without, with like regular beef, but they're better with the meatloaf mix. Okay, so I'll be back. 